My name's James Austin and I'm the theatre manager here in St Joseph's Hospital. I'm responsible for all theatres within the hospital, uh, the staffing, ensuring staff morale is high, ensuring that patient safety and quality of care is really high and that we're continually monitoring that care. We've got four theatres and an endoscopy unit. Uh, in our main theatre suite, we've got two theatres where we do the more uh, complex inpatient procedures and then we've got some day case theatres. The whole idea is that uh, the patient comes into theatre, has their, has their surgery and is discharged the, the same day. In theatres of St Joseph's, the patient's at the centre of everything that we do. In the short time that we have to get to know that patient, we try and learn as much as we can about them. We try and make their experience as calm and relaxed and pleasant as possible. People in St Joseph's genuinely do care about their patients and will take the time to calm a patient's anxieties, hold a patient's hand. If you compare us to larger organisations or larger hospitals, there's a huge difference. We're quite a small team. I would say we're, we're quite like a family because we work together so frequently and we spend a lot of time in work. Uh, so you really get to know the other people you're working with. You get to know their skills, what they're good at, what they need help with. Work itself is a really, really social experience as well. We genuinely have so much fun doing the jobs that we do. We're able to have a laugh together at the right time. We generally do have really good relationships and like being around each other. I see part of my role as theatre manager, not just look after the patients, but we've got to look after the team, we've got to look after the staff and make sure that they're getting time off, make sure that they're getting the rest they need, but also that they feel nurtured and cared about. Within the theatre department, we've got a wealth of experience. We've got people who've worked in theatres for 15, 20, 30 years, and they've got so much knowledge to impart to new starters. So whether you've been experienced for one year or 10 years, this we've got something to offer in St Joseph's. If you compare to a local tertiary hospital, district general hospital, it's a relatively small team. The advantages of that are we're all a family, we get on very well and we know how each other works and what makes each other tick and we all feed off each other's experiences and learn from each other. There's certainly career progression in St Joseph's. There's a definitive career structure within the theatre department with leadership positions available. New members of the staff, whether you're newly qualified or whether you've got a wealth of experience, will ensure there's a period where you're working as a supernumerary member of staff. So you get to get used to the working environment, get used to the people around you and feel comfortable within your role. If you're newly qualified, we'll assign you a, an experienced mentor, we'll identify any training needs and we'll either organise in-house or external training for, for you. The one thing I think sets St Joseph's apart is that you still see people holding a patient's hand here. And I think that's so important. I feel really proud to do the job that I do. And I feel it's a privilege to work in theatres and to be part of that patient's journey.